let's take you to our special report on Oba Abduwasi Wamogbola on Adisalawal, the new Oniru of Aero Kingdom. Kabis you. Many knew Bolahan Lawal as one of the Lagos princes, but never knew he would become a king so soon. As the Commissioner for Housing under the Akimu Miyambode administration, Bolahan Lawal was up and doing and made sure that hundreds of tenants turned landlords in a mega city like Lagos. Thanks to the Lagos Home Ownership Mortgage Scheme, Lagos Homes, founded by the Babatunde Fashola administration to encourage and support home ownership of first-time buyer residents of Lagos State. Following the success of Agric Yes as a coordinator of the Agriculture-Based Youth Empowerment Scheme in 2009, Bolaon Lawal was appointed as Lagos State Commissioner for Agriculture and Cooperative in 2011. As Commissioner for Agric in the Babaji De Sonwolu administration, the prince's performance was second to none, especially during the distribution of COVID-19 economic stimulus package meant for the indigents and the most vulnerable in the society to cushioning the effects of the stay-at-home order. As far as we are concerned, we want to see how we can provide the social safety net. That is the essence of this program. So Hundreds of youth were engaged at the rebargaining and distribution centers. On behalf of the state government, Prince Lawal also received palliatives from the federal government to further help the poor. So on behalf of the good people of Lagos State, we want to thank uh, President Muhammad Buhari for this kind gesture. On June the 4th, news broke that the Commissioner for Agric had resigned from the Lagos State Cabinet to pursue his dream as a king. Then the video of how Oba Lawal entered Ikebi a seclusion where all rights are done for new kings ahead of installation went viral. On the 7th of June, Governor of Lagos State, Babaji De Sonwolu, presented the staff of office to Abduwasiu Omogbolawan Lawal Abisogun II as the new Oniru of Iru Land. Please, can I have a resounding cap, please, you. Due to COVID-19 pandemic, the event was marked on Loki and the announcement of the newest king in town. Drummers had a fun field day. Ijinla fraternity was a key component of the Lagos traditional occasion. The transition of the former Oniru or Bayesufa Biodu Oniru from the Aki Ogun ruling house in September 2019 paved way for Oba Abduwasi Omogbolawan Lawal's emergence as new king of Iru land. The new Oba emerged from the Abisogun ruling house, his mother's lineage. You should leave the Oniru palace better than how you make it. Education closer to God. This is the first traditional ruler the governor would be installing, and fittingly, he is his former commissioner for a Greek. On behalf of the people and government of Lagos State, I have the honor to present the staff of office in Royal Majesty of Abdulwasiu Omogbalaon Lawa, the Abisoku Second, the Onimu of Thank you. 
At the event, the new traditional ruler offered the olive branch to other aspirants to the throne. Some of my brothers, especially Adeshek Moneru and Prince Akim Ajasa, I want to extend my hand of uh, fellowship to all of you. This is where we call home, and so shall it be by the grace of Almighty Allah. To maintain the physical distancing, K1 the Ultimate entertained the guests from Ijebuode in Ogun State virtually. <laughs> Fifty year old Bola Olawal is from the Ojora Aromire and Abisogun branch of Oniru royal families of Lagos State. His mother was an Oniru princess. The installation rise of His Majesty Oba Abduwasi Omogbolawan Adisalawal as the 15th Oniru of Iru land in Lagos State reached its peak with the coronation reception and public presentation of the kingdom insignia on Sunday, September the 6th, 2020. <laughs> A roll call of VIPs, administrators, politicians, led by the national leader of the All Progressives Congress, APC, Ashwaju Bolatino, who the king was his ADC at the age of 29, graced the occasion. Lagos State Governor Babajide Sonwolu, traditional rulers within and outside of the state, including the All Ni of Ife, Obaini Tsongusi, and the representatives of Oba of Lagos, Alayelua, Riwan, Akiolu, were all present. Today begins another significant chapter in the annals of our beloved Irulan, as well as my life's journey. This personally brings to, to my mind the complexity of life as espoused by the famous Gartnes when he said, and I quote, Does the worker choose the path, or the path the worker? End of quote. I am convinced that all these were in Allah's predetermined plans, who makes us as pencils in his magnificent hands. Governor Babajide Sonwolu was represented by the Deputy Governor, Dr. Obafemi Hamzat. During the installation ceremony, I recall enjoining His Royal Majesty to strengthen the existing bond of unity within your land for the overall development of and peace and progress of this kingdom and Lagos state in general. Three months on the throne, I'm pleased to note that KBSC took this advice to act as exemplified by his very impressive actions characterized by wisdom, knowledge, and large art awareness. Ashwa Jutinubu vouched for the leadership qualities of the monarch pointing out that Obalawal had enormous capacity to endure, learn, and listen. How well you focus on the development and progress of your land is in your hand. You can't achieve it alone without the support of the government. You can't achieve it without peace. We have seen Lagos progress. I'm very proud of you. I am very proud of the courage you are we're celebrating today. The fact we started together, he endured, he learned, he listened, he's caring, he's very honest, he's very reliable, very dynamic. Inside Lagos visited Iru land where the Oniru stool is situated. Now is everything. Yeah, we were welcomed to the palace by one of his aides. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Yes. 
we wait here alongside his chiefs who already had an outing with the king. And here comes the Oniru of Iru Kingdom. His wife is Olori Miriam Lawal. We deliver a gift as a token of love. You can't come to the palace empty handed. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. All right, Kabesi, we would like to know um, the first time you heard that um, you're going to succeed the former king, or Kabesi Oba Abiodu Oniru, what came to your mind? Naturally, I was elated. I was happy. Uh, having gone through the selection process and the nomination and the approval of the, the governor and the executive council of Lagos State, I was elated like every uh, normal woman. What are the innovations we are bringing to the throne? Uh, areas where we can quickly reduce poverty, mm. areas where we can quickly uh, bring about uh, um, um, parallel development. Mm. You know, if you look at the the location, the strategic location of this kingdom, we have the, the, the Atlantic uh, beach. And uh, we believe it is important for us to see how we can explore the opportunities in tourism. It's very important. You've been in the public service for a very long time. And um, here you are in the Nero Kingdom. What, what, what's the difference? It's an extension of public service. But as a monarch, you're, you're closer to the community. Mm. So as a commissioner, you're attending to the, the issues or matters of the states. Mm. But now you are attending to the matters of the community or the com your kingdom. Obaoniru speaks on integrity as one of the weapons that qualified him for the throne. All my life I've always believed whatever you want, whether you're in the political palace or you want to be, you have to have that integrity. You must make sure that you don't have any scandal, you must make sure that you are transparent so that you don't, you know, yeah. if if you have any any criminal or uh, whatever, mm. there's no way anybody will nominate you as a yeah. as a That's as a monarch. Go and check. Yeah. You understand? Mm. So so if you want to be a member of House of Assembly or Commissioner, you must have your your record must be straight. This is in the constitution. So the same goes for if you want to be a king. Then his appreciation. It's a good opportunity for me to thank the the Almighty Allah. Mm. Made it and, and our ancestors that made it possible for me to be on this throne. They have been so long uh, ruling us. My mother, who is uh, who, who is uh, very loving and caring, actually, the I met you know, who mentored me, who gave me the, the political maturity and the the administrative mm -hmm. capability. Cabis, the allied war of Iluanu has been a, a pillar of support. And my brother King, the uh, allied law of uh, Saeed Ademale Lebushi, of Adjiron uh, uh, from Jomunland. And to you. And then prayers. I want to go to the house. I want Why 
And from the palace of Oniru of Iru Kingdom, His Royal Majesty Oba Abduwasiu Omogbolawan Adisa Lawal Abisogo II Kabesiu. We wrap it up on today's edition of Inside Lagos. Don't forget COVID-19 is still out there. Continue to take all the necessary precautions. I'm Ade Doja. Salam Adeni. See you next time. Thanks for watching.